Batch processing is a very powerful feature in raw power, but it's also easy to use. Batch processing is the ability to make a change to multiple images at the same time. To use batch processing, just select a bunch of images in the grid. Then tap the batch button to see the choices. You can see that you can flag or unflag images, apply auto enhance, paste the adjustments that you made to the last image you edited, apply a preset, export multiple images, download images from iCloud, revert to original, or generate raw previews. This last command is useful if your camera shoots raw images with a small embedded JPEG. The first thing I'll do is bring up the batch export interface. As you can see, there's a number of settings. The first is file format, JPEG, TIFF, PNG, including 16-bit versions, color profile, file naming, and sizes. There's a bunch built in as well as a custom size option. You can export either to the Files app or to Photos. If you choose Photos, then you also get to choose the album that the export images will go into. If you choose to apply a preset, you'll get your choice of the presets that you have in the system. I'll apply Batch Auto Enhance. Progress comes up. You can press Cancel if you want to cancel the operation. And then if you're using the photo library, it will ask you at the end to commit the changes to the library or you can cancel. And that's a quick tour of batch processing in raw power. Thanks for watching.